Sabitri, Book 2, Canto 10, The Kingdoms and Godheads of the Little Mind, page number 257, deemed by the imperfection of its means, the little mind is tied to little things. Its sense is but the spirit's outward touch, half wet in a world of dark inconscience. It feels out for its beings and its forms, like one left fumbling in the ignorant night in this small mold of infant mind and sense. Desire is a child heart's cry, crying for bliss, our reason only a toy's artificer. A rule maker in a strange stumbling game, but see her dwarf heads new, whose confident shy. A bounded prospect to for the far goal, the world she has made is an interim report of a traveler towards the half found truth in things, moving twist nations and nations, for nothing is known while aught remains concealed, the truth is known only when all is seen. Attracted by the all that is the one, she yearns towards a higher light than hers. Hid by her calls and creeds, she has glimpsed God's face. She knows she has but found a form, a robe. But ever she hopes to see him in her heart, and fill the body of his reality. As yet a mask is there and not a bro, although sometimes two hidden eyes appear. Reason cannot tear up that glimmering mask, her efforts only make it glimmer more. In packets she ties up the indivisible, finding her hands too small to hold vast truth. She breaks off knowledge into alien parts or peers through cloud wrath for a vanished sun. She sees not understanding what she has seen through the locked visages of finite things. The myriad aspect of infinity, one day the face must burn out through the mask. Our ignorance is wisdom's chrysalis. Our ignorance is wisdom's chrysalis. Om Sabitri, Om Sabitri, Om Sabitri.